Hey, what's going on you guys? I'm Austin White from AreaMediaPros.com. Today I'm going to go over the Phantom 2 with you and how to set up your remote so you have the ability to go from GPS to attitude to manual mode. Now the Phantom 2 no longer comes with the ability to do that. We have to go into our software and program it ourselves. So I'm going to go through a few things with you. First take your USB cord. You want to plug it into the front of the copter like so. Always please remember to take off your props. It's a safety thing. It's great for you. Go to your computer and start up the new Phantom 2 software. Once you open the Phantom 2 software, you'll notice where it says normal fly, normal fly, normal fly. You're going to want to go up and press the Phantom 2 at the top. You'll be prompted. You need to click yes. You'll be prompted again. You need to click yes again. And then for a third time, you need to click OK. Now you'll notice down here where it said normal fly. It now says GPS, attitude, attitude. These are your flight controls. You're also able to change attitude to fail safe or to manual mode at the end. We, we recommend you leave it on attitude. Now you need to do a stick calibration. Click start. Please do one stick at a time. Make for sure you hit all the endpoints. Once you're finished, click finish. Then click OK. Now you're going to do an X1 calibration. This is your Zen Muse gimbal control. Once again, hit all your endpoints, then let go. All right, so once you got everything upgraded, the biggest thing you need to do, unplug it and go for a test fly. Cool. Make for sure now you have a charged battery. Once you do that, take off. We usually take off in attitude mode and then switch to GPS mode once we're in there. And when we have signal, everything's good to go. Do a little flying to test her out and everything's great. Thanks for watching, you guys. And remember, AerialMediaPros.com has all your aerial cinematography needs. And check back for some more tutorials in the future.